Okay, I'm getting my uh, lifters set up. I've dropped them in. I soaked them in oil for about two hours. And I dropped them in the bore. It's, uh, when putting these dog bones on, it's very important that you get them right side up. They're labeled, but you can see if it's upside down, it's up in the air. It's not sitting flat on the block. And that means it's going to move, the center's going to move up and down and eventually fatigue the uh, spider that's in there. So you can see they have a step in there. So it has to go that way. So I'm going to oil these up, uh, drop those in, put in my spider. I'm going to clean the spider off. And I got my little two set screws. They just need some thread locker and five foot pounds not much at all i'm going to do that right now all right i put the uh lifter guides i guess they're called uh lots of them call them dog bones put those in put my spider tray in and i bolted it down uh, the first time i put this in here this one right here was touching and it had it's this is like spring steel so it springs a lot I don't know if you can tell. But the first time uh, I put it in, it was touching. So it was using a spring force to push sideways against this uh, guide, which is going to put a constant force on the side of the lifter. So I took it back off, uh, bent it a little bit so there's no, no tension on there because it is spring. So, and then all the rest of them look pretty good. Yeah, none of them are pushing sideways. Okay, so I'm just going to pull each bolt out, put some Loctite on there, and uh, torque it down to 5 foot-pounds.